Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Look at me, like a proud Englishman, as the cock screams. Smile like a Cheshire cat. <laughs> Congratulations and well done to Mr. Trump and the American people on your win. But please let it be known, this win was not just for America. This win was for Great Britain, Europe, the Western civilization, and most importantly, a win for human decency, morals. Now, I want to say a quick thank you to all those unsung heroes. Who are those unsung heroes? Those unsung heroes are you guys and all those who attended the rallies over the last 18 months in London. Because Trump was heavily promoted and we showed great support for Trump. Now, my American brothers and sisters, a lot of them were sitting on their hands, not sure what way to turn. But when they see such support for Trump and the admiration they have for us British, their minds were made. Their minds were made. Now, my next point, I want to talk about leaders, leadership. If you're a true leader, you shall stand by the stone that you throw, regardless of the consequences. Now, Mr. Lemmy, you didn't just throw a stone. You threw a racist rock at Mr. Trump, calling him a racist, a Nazi, and that you would take to the streets in protest if he was to visit England or get in power. Now, let's see if you stand by the stone that you throw. Because this morning I see a tweet from you congratulating him and welcoming him to England. Now, this, ladies and gentlemen, is a clear sign of people who are playing the role as leaderships. And it's not right. Now, the same man I address you with is the same man who's been addressing Putin with such strong words and big stones thrown to Putin and his acquaintances. And we therefore know now he hasn't got the, the integrity, the dignity to back up that stone which he threw. Now, worrying times, really, when you have people like that around you who are willing to throw the stone but not stand by the consequences regardless. So I live my life as a true gentleman. I stand by my morals, my opinions and my dignity. No matter what the outcome, I will not change my opinions or my morals or my actions to platform or to benefit financially. Because that's the blood that runs through my veins for my ancestors. So take from this message what you will. Have a great day again. Well done, everyone. Well done, Mr. Trump. God bless you. God bless me. God bless our motherland.